it's Hammer and Hatchet Engineering, and today I'm installing the new emergency brake cables. I already got one in, and I'll show you how to do this one. I got these from Moss. It's got the grease nipple on it, so I'll be able to have a better maintenance um, by being able to grease the um, emergency brake cables. I'm going to put this in fast forward, so um, it's Hammer and Hatchet Engineering over and out. Well, it's Hammer and Hatchet Engineering, and I got the second brake cable in. I had it on slow mode, and I was trying to do time lapse. So anyway, I got this part in, and, that, and then I put the new cable attached to the emergency brake part, new cotter pin, and now I'm going to stick it into the car and hook it up to the emergency brake. I'll put this one in time lapse. Well, I've got the new cables in, but I seem to be having an adjustment problem already. I haven't even got it completely set. The, I don't know if I have to disconnect the, the down there first so I can let it spin. I gotta, anyway. So I'm not really sure. It seems like it's a little short. These are from Moss. Yeah, I'll we'll figure it out. Let's see. Take a break. Hammer and Hatchet Engineering, and I finally got the emergency brake working or adjusted. It was kind of a bear. I had to. I don't know if you can see it down there I had to kind of lift, lift that arm out just so I can get the cable through to that nut and um, but it seems to work I'm learning how to do that fly off thing so you can basically it's kind of locks in and it's locked and then you don't have to press this button, you just do that. And that, so now it seems like I'm going to, it's dragging a little bit. I have to, may have to adjust that. All right, Hammer and Hatchet Engineering, over now.